And if you have not been, huh? The Simple Soul Band. The Simple Soul Band. And uh, what did y'all last perform at? Last perform in God's Tennessee. In God's Tennessee. Down at Harry Wade's place. And what are you, and I, uh, this uh, is coming to you from our Rescue Life Products Studio J, the Bird's Eye View here on Rapid Grant Road. We had a view in Linda uh, from Simple Soul. And uh, she uh, was informing me that the number of people who are tuning in to YouTube and, and that they are uh, listening at the music, they like their music, and they're right now in their semi uh, uh, tour where they're offering to come in the, uh, the neighborhood where you're at and, uh, and to uh, say uh, uh, at your activities. And uh, uh, just tell me more about it. Well, I was, uh, uh, we, we are working on a lot of new things and we learned a lot of new terms. And we uh, just recently hired Danny Ray Williams. He's a country singer and a rhythm and blues singer also. And so he's recently joined our band and we get ready to carry out that. And my brother-in-law, Bobby Jones, he's a drummer, but he also sings on the What do y'all have? And director, our band directed uh, Mr. Justin McKinney from Texas, and now running his Dickie Moe's is uh, uh, a road manager. Uh, he's the owner of the Lightning Car Wash area, Bobby Moe, and the lead guitar player. Well, how can you? Willie Cook is from Tupelo, Mississippi. Uh, Carrie Knox from LA. Uh, we have uh, Richard Hurst from Jackson, Tennessee. Now, Alan Boone. And uh, some, and we used to have a George Wright, he's in and out of the band. Well, uh, oh, yeah, we got some wonderful members of the band. I'm Linda Jones. Well, I'm, uh, a lot of people have been concerned, uh, been asking about the fashion that you wear, uh, and I, I'm of the understanding that you uh, uh, make some of these items yourself. Tell me about uh, uh, your. I, I designed my hats and uh, I, I designed my outfits, and what I really do sometimes is like. Uh, I really make clothes, I redesign them. I like to have make uh, clothes that I went out of style. I redesign them and, and you know, make them upgrade them, you know. I give them a face. <laughs> oh, you give them a face that so in other words you can take a, a, a simple design and turn it into something uh, very valuable yeah, yeah. and worthwhile. Uh just turn it into a fashion design. Well yeah, uh, how can I also do hair, I'm a vacation also. Oh, you are you a multi talented individual. Well, uh, yes, and I'm a, uh, I'm a, I, I used to be with the fantastic thrillers in Chicago, Illinois, and I've also uh, done started my career out with Tyrone Davis, Bobby Rudd, and Dick Willis. Bobby Rudd. Uh, anybody uh, uh, familiar with the rhythm and blues know uh, Tyrone Davis was a great singer, and also uh, Bobby Rudd. Well, well, although you are, yeah. although you are talking to me by uh, telephone right now, is it possible that once uh, the Re Rescue Life Bird's Eye View Studios open, that you come in and be on the air uh, live with the Rescue Life product? I'd be willing to. I'd be glad to do it. Uh, well, your interview. Well, we want and you to. My uh, uh, manager, Rick Kelly, pretty sure he'd be willing to join me. All right. Well, we want to talk to you at length about your uh, fashion design as well as your uh, uh, beautician work and uh, and just get a, a little bit better understanding of what where the soul come from in the uh, little simple soul that bad. Uh, I also want to mention the fact that my sister Glenda Jones is married to the drummer Bobby Jones. Oh, is that correct? And a, and a, and a member of uh, and a member of uh, connected to the better Bobby Moe because Bobby Moe's uh, uh, son is better <laughs> than my niece. Alright, well let me ask you, uh, about, I don't want to interrupt you, but uh, uh, tell me a little bit about Bobby. Does he, has he ever traveled with a, a, a band or anything like that? Uh, to make world tools? Actually, both Bobby, yeah, Bobby Moe's uh, with Lanier and Justin, they were out in the band uh, and uh, Bobby Jones traveled with the people that's your brother, mother. I'm on my way to Okinawa, you know, so. Okinawa, you think? Well, Jess McKinney, our band director, been at least for 40 years. And most of the guys, I, for 20 to 50 years. Uh, oh. Bill Keller, they're 
Well, we look uh, professional. Well, we look forward to having uh, each of you on, and you can give your perspective on uh, Temple Soul. Uh, will you be performing in Chester County area anytime soon? We will. We'll probably will. If it's not like that, other than down at uh, uh, Ronnie Moe's Black and Crowd Watching Lounge. I think he's supposed to have a motorcycle show, a club show there pretty soon. But uh, we got some future shows coming up, and I'll keep you posted. Okay, well. We're going to let this be a wrap up here, and uh, we appreciate you calling in uh, to Bird's Eye View Studio J right out here on Rabbit Ranch Road in Henderson, Tennessee. Uh, you stream broadcasting you uh, across the nation as well as Logitech Web uh, contribution to making this program possible today. Thank you very much, Linda Simpasso.